morning everyone today is the first day of classes I have two classes today and tomorrow I have one the next day I have one and then the next day I have one as well I'm meeting a couple friends down in the lobby and we are gonna walk the route together and let's see how the day goes kind of nervous for classes. I'm not sure what to expect, so I think that's why I'm a little bit more nervous, but I think today's gonna be good. I only have two classes, so I'll only be at IES for, I think each class is around two hours, and after that, I'm probably gonna come back, get situated for my next class tomorrow, do some readings. I had to do some readings last night for a few classes today even though it's the first day. I don't think they do a syllabus week, so we actually start classes like right away. And the readings were good. It wasn't boring at all. It was very interesting. We are walking to our classes. There's Sydney and Rachel. They're walking to one building and I have to go find another. We're but scared. They're nervous. First day of class. Nervous. I get to go learn nervous. about the wars. British censorship, which we love to learn about. I'm doing oh. British youth culture, so I'm very excited for my first one. That'll be cool, that's like the Beatles and stuff. Yeah, that'll be good. Bye now. Bye. 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 with my first class. I liked it a lot. And now I am walking to meet Sydney and Rachel. Uh, I think we're going back to prep. I'm not sure. We want to grab a little snack before our next one starts. Our next class starts in an hour. So we have a little bit of a break. I'm walking around a little bit exploring. My professor, he does speak in a British accent. So it was interesting. And the film that we watched, it was a British film as well, so it was really cool seeing the culture back in the 50s and 60s on the different gangs and all that stuff and to be able to compare it to American. But, cute little flowers up here. Pret is good, we're Pret girls. I'm Mara. Um, my first class was at Queen Mary, so way far away from where everybody else has classes. I went there, got there all good, and my class was canceled. So that's how my first class in London went. It's not my first class. It was censored, but the British could not see. So it was all about like British censorship and film, which is cool. Because I want to learn more about movies and stuff. And I'm not a few cute guys, so we love that. <laughs> Other than that, it was really good, and now I'm ready for my next class, International Business. Um, if you ever come here, do not take part in the 1940s from literature. It's just about the worst class you ever take, and you will guarantee you fall asleep seven nights. I have two classes today. The first one is International Finance, which I have in 20 minutes. Very fun. I'm really bad at math, so that will be interesting. I have my first class next, and it's censorship. Um, I've heard good things. I'm also in that class too, so we are gonna go there after. I just finished my classes and met Allie. There were she two and a half out. hours. Her. I had so much fun in my classes. They were great. All my professors are great. I love it. And look at our view. So I am back from classes and I am pretty tired. So tonight, I don't think anyone's going out. I think we are all just chilling and hanging out here. I personally want to take a mini nap and I also want to read my book that I have not read. I'm currently in my new Zara jeans that were $10 that I got the other day. And these are my thermals that I told y'all I always wear. I have been wearing these around just like this. I am going to change into something a little bit more comfortable and get in bed to sleep a little bit. The jet lag has not been fun. I thought I would be used to it by now, but that is very false. My body is still taking a lot of time to get used to it. My stomach starts growling at 1 a.m., which is super weird and uncomfortable because you're trying to go to sleep. You know it's past your bedtime, you should not be up, but your stomach is screaming at you to eat dinner. All in all, classes were great today. I love my professors, both of them are amazing. One of them speaks in a British accent. The other one, she is American, but she married a British man 
and she has a one-year-old actually and she lives in London. I don't think it's gonna be too hard of a semester, but anyways, I will see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Good morning, everyone. So just a tad bit of an update to this vlog. Today is actually a week later than when you saw me. So I got COVID on Tuesday. I showed y'all my class on Monday, got COVID Tuesday. I was in quarantine that whole entire week, so I did not do absolutely anything. And it put a little dent in me showing you my first week of classes. So technically, this will still be my first week of classes because it's my first week attending them. I'm gonna bring y'all along starting today. Today is Tuesday, and so I already showed you my Monday schedule. We'll still keep that there, but this is Tuesday. I'm gonna show you my classes. Tomorrow I have two more classes, so I'm gonna finish this vlog as if it didn't put a little dent in the plans. It's a super exciting day. I'm a little bit more dressed up than I usually prefer, for class, but that is because I'm going to high tea after with a fellow classmate, a friend. It is a famous high tea place. It's called Sketch. It looks like Wonderland. That's what, it's like an Alice in Wonderland themed high tea place. It's famous for its pink room, if you know the pink room in London. We're gonna get some cute pictures. We're gonna get all dressed up. Yeah, so exciting. Let's go to class. I'm a little bit behind schedule. friend and we are going to sketch. We're on our way, we're waiting for the tube. We're so excited. It's, it's, so excited. it's an easy way to get there too from IES, so yeah. Hold your breath, make a wish, count to three. Come with me and you'll be in a world of pure imagination. Take a look and you'll see into your dimension. It is gorgeous. It is magical. Amazing. And we're waiting on our first course. In the world of my creation, what we'll see will defy explanation. I'll show you how I have learned to like it. I like brown sugar better than sugar. We're doing a whole packet because I'm from Georgia and I like sweet tea. And then the truth comes out. We're spilling the tea. It's a good day. <laughs> Just a tad. That's how we make the tea. A little cloudy. Cheers. Beautiful. <laughs> No life I know to compare with pure imagination living there. You'll be this is the reality behind everything. Um, phone, my professional camera, her phone, and then the camera that I'm on right now. So I'm talking to y'all. <laughs> that's, that's how it works when influencers or people who like to content create come together. And we are having so much fun together. I think the key to a good tea Afternoon tea is a good date, and I have yeah. the best one right here, so. <laughs> change the world there's nothing to it update we have been here for exactly three hours it is time for us to leave we are asking for the check it has been such a lovely time as you can hear the beautiful music in the back it was amazing talking to Kenzie and I'm so happy that she came with me she is such a sweet person an amazing person if you truly
I am home. I have been hanging out with the girls. We've been all in my room just hanging out. But tonight we have decided that we are all going to the pub just for a few hours. And we're all meeting down in the lobby in about five minutes. So I actually need to hurry up, but I wanted to vlog this and take you along because I told you I'd show you my week of classes. So this is what we're doing. So I have the tan turtleneck on with the low waist and my Nike. Morning. This is it's Wednesday. We are about to walk to class. I have two classes today. We have two, but we're going to the cinema field trip. I get to go to the British Museum. That's the architecture. Walking to my next class, it is Architecture of London. So we will be doing a walking tour of the city. It is a little bit sunny out. It keeps peeking through, so that's great. And this is the last class of my week and day. class here in the British Museum. Nice, a lot of nice columns. We are about to leave. From another lover. I just went to the grocery store and to get there, how that works is I walk 15 minutes to this one grocery store and then I got all my groceries. As you can see, I have them in these little reusable bags because here you have to pay for bags and it's not really realistic to have plastic bags and you walking around with plastic bags if you go to the grocery store here everyone has their own reusable bags or reusable um like a rolling backpack it's what i like how i want to describe it where you can put your groceries in which is really cool so i have this and then i took the bus home so i went to one of the stops it was only three stops until here brought me back Super simple, super easy. Now, I need to put all my groceries up. I think I might do a grocery haul later on. I actually just bought, I'm very excited about this, containers because they don't offer them here in our shared kitchen and we don't have anything like that. We have pots and pans and spoons, all that kind of stuff, um, utensils, but we do not have these containers. So if you cook something, you just have to toss it away because you don't have Ziploc bags already or you don't have these things. So now I can start cooking and saving it and then reheating it for the next day, which is a game changer. It will save me a lot of money. I spent, I think 50 pounds for all this and that's around two meals in Covent Garden, for example. That's with a drink. So I am about to save so much money because I am spending a lot of money so far. That has been a real struggle, but that can be another topic on another day. Like, subscribe, let me know what you wanna see. That's about it. And thanks for following along with my week. Tomorrow I have no class, so this is my last day of class. And it's time for the weekend. So, bye guys. See you later.